Meghan Markle royal baby. How Meghan Markle took longer on maternity leave than Kate. Meghan Markle will return to work this week, spelling an end to her maternity leave. The Duchess of Sussex stepped back from royal duties following the birth of baby Archie. But how long did she have off compared to Kate, Duchess of Cambridge? Meghan Markle, 38, took a break from royal duties to take care for her newborn son following baby Archie Harrison's birth on May 6th. While Prince Harry was back to work just days after baby Archie's arrival, Meghan took four months of maternity leave to take care of the tiny tot. The Duchess has announced she will officially return to work this Thursday, spelling an end to her maternity leave. How much maternity leave parents choose to take is a personal decision that is different for everyone. The Kate, Duchess of Cambridge, 37, took considerably less time off following the birth of her first child, George VI, than she did for her youngest prince, Louis I. Following Prince George's birth, Kate took just one month's maternity leave before she returned to work. After Prince Louis was born, the Duchess took her longest maternity leave yet seven months. The mom of three is understood to have taken a longer break with Louise than with previous pregnancies because she wished to spend more time caring for all three of her children. While Meghan has been busy in recent weeks for maternity does not officially end until September 12th. She will mark her return to work on September 12th when she attends a launch event for the charity clothing line she designed with her friend Misha Nona. While the fashion line launch will be her first official work event since Archie's birth, Meghan has had a very busy few weeks. She joined Prince Harry at the Queen's official birthday celebrations, tripping the collar in June, and attended the Lion King premiere in London on July 14. The Duchess also had a huge hand in September's issue of British Vogue, which she guest edited. While most of the work towards the magazine took place before Archie was born, you can imagine some final touches would have been made when Meghan was already a mom. More recently, Meghan has jetted off with Prince Harry and Archie for holidays in Ibiza and France. She also took a solo trip to New York at the weekend to watch Serena Williams play in the US Open final. Later this month, the Sussex clan will head to Africa for a 10-day tour. Meghan, Harry and baby Archie will touch down in South Africa on September 23rd, while Prince Harry heads to Botswana and Angola, Malawi. Meghan will carry out several royal visits in South Africa. They will reunite in Johannesburg the final days of the tour before heading back to Britain.